Last bit of rules from the referee here. Here we go. It's on and cracking. Referee checking for the judges. Judge. The judges are checked. Time and ready. About to be underway. Here we go. Oh! oh. Push kick. Oh! Oh, <laughs> here we go. We have a fight now. Oh, the Cambodian throwing some taunts. And now down to the ground he goes. I told you that Jirawat has a significant wrestling advantage here. I would not be surprised if this is the whole game plan for him. Yeah. Take him down, beat him up. Oh. Getting swept and... Wow, oh, what, what a wild. scramble. What a wild scramble. And up and down. Oh. Straight to the ground again we go. Wild fight here. Jirawat on top. Let's see if he can maintain his control this time. Yeah, I'll say this from the bottom. You know, you see this over, uh, under position. It's really solid. It's stopping from taking any major damage. But, you know, being on the bottom is never a good idea. Never good. Never good. It's also exhausting just clinching an opponent from the bottom, trying to hold on. Oh, nice up elbow there, though. Landed a, a sharp one there. You know, the 12 to uh, 6 elbows are legal. Uh, also, knees to the head are legal. Soccer kicks are also legal. Yeah, changes the dynamic of a fight from that uh, of the uh, unified rules we see in America. Get another stand up here. Three minutes, 45 to go in a crazy yeah, opening an segment. exciting fight, yeah. Oh, nice uh, hard kick there. Single leg, guillotine. He's working on the guillotine here. Oh, nice pull he's got on that guillotine, but a head pops free, and he's back on top. Very active round Very active. so far. Yeah, both guys just really working to damage each other. Oh, going completely old school with those heels to the kidneys. Some hoist Gracie kidney kicks. All right, oh, elbow working the from elbows the bottom, the bottom. This is a scrap. Yeah. Foot on the hips, knows what he's doing, trying to create some space. Yeah, I like what up. I'm seeing from the Cambodian. Yeah, Facebook Live is getting their money's worth, and they didn't pay a damn dime. All right, a little, little law in the action here as the fighters kind of adjust. He is standing over, looking for some action. Hammer fist coming down. Referee telling him to watch his fingers. Ooh. Yeah, Mesma is uh, surprisingly active here from the bottom. Kicks. Oh. You know. Wrestling advantage is clearly dominant here to the Thai guy, but I'm telling you, it's uh, it's not being easy on him. Yeah, the Cambodian is scrappy. Even though he's on the bottom, he's being very active. Yeah, throwing up Punching elbows. Up. Yeah, up elbows, uh, little short shots. He's stacked against the cage here. This is a pretty awful position to be in if your head's against the cage and someone's in your guard. It's pretty nasty. Yeah, especially with the knees and elbows legal. Oh, yeah, oh, some big elbows coming big down elbows. now. I'm close enough to get splashed with Cambodian blood. The referee uh, really on top of this. Oh, just no room, no ability to get any space whatsoever. As soon as he gets a look. Gets yeah. closed up straight away. That wrestling, yeah. those heavy hips are making a difference here. Yeah, this is what we call the grind this position. As yeah. ugly as it gets. Yeah, you just keep heavy on the guy, wear him out, wear him out. Here, here's another hammer fist. Big oh, an overhand in. left gets through. I hear a grunt from the Cambodian fighter. Yeah, now just really pushing on him right here in front of my commentary position. That last few seconds of the round, totally dominant top position here by our Thai fighter. One minute to go. Yeah. I don't think there's any. Oh, the referee decides to stand him up. Not enough action. Cambodian quick to get up. Makes go. move. Stalking straight away. right into a double leg. And slam. Down Back, we go again. again. Wrestling superiority here is starting to. This is going to be a long night if it's three rounds of this. It's going to be a very, very long night. For yeah, yeah. Well, I, well, you know, every time that they get back up is going to be more and more interesting because uh, this Cambodia is fighting with a desperation that I haven't seen, uh, I don't know, ever. 
Yeah, it'd be interesting to see if they can keep this up in later frames of this fight because the pace is insane at the moment. Yeah, yeah, these guys are at it like two rats fucking in a wolf sock. <laughs> ten seconds All left. Right, ten seconds to go. More of the same from Jiro Watts staying on top, staying heavy, doing damage, but not taking any real risks. Strong, strong finish to the tie. I mean, that was a down. very strong wrestling round for the Thai fighter. And now the Cambodian is looking beat, mad, and looking for vengeance in round two. We'll see if he uh, stays as aggressive or if he knows the takedown's a threat and decides to keep his distance and try to pick him apart. Let's hope he doesn't care. Oh, oh front, front kick. kick right to the face. Oh. Nice hip toss. Soccer oh. kick, miss, miss. This is a wild fight. No soccer. Oh, it looks like we're getting back started. All right, we're back in. All right. Oh, front kick, down to the double leg. You know, you know the, the moral of this story is you gotta protect yourself from takedowns. You know, I, I really like uh, Miss Mu from Cambodia's uh, heart where he just is going for it. What happened? Not exactly oh, now we sure have like some type of complaint. These guys are about to get into a fight, I think. I don't know. <laughs> Oh. All right, so nice sportsmanship. Now, prescribed violence, here we go. Oh, big open leg kick. Brutal nice. leg kick. Brutal. I felt that Absolutely. one over here. Another headlock down to the ground. And Joe Benz is on top. Yep, Joe Benz is landing some good shots. Doing a very good job of here. Yeah, Mace Moo is scrambling though. Knees to the head. Knees to the head are legal, so he's looking for one. Oh, Mace Moo uh, recomposes his guard. So now he's in a more safe position. But again, back against the cage. Trying to do his best in his full guard position. Hasn't really threatened anything, but stays very active. Got up elbows, gets foot on the hip, shrimps away. I mean, this has been a strange round. We've already had like two stoppages in the short amount of time that they've been fighting. So, you know, there, there's a lot of time left. There appears to be something to this Thai versus Cambodia rivalry. I don't know. I don't know. It makes for good TV. Oh, some nasty elbows coming from the bottom. Very, very nasty. That will absolutely change the course of the fight. Do a double elbow. Double elbow. Going full Donkey Kong. Yeah, we. What do we look? We have we have an Americana attempt on the bottom. <laughs> Man, it doesn't get any better than this. The strangest fight I've ever watched, I think. Here we go. Back to work, or the referee will stand him up. Oh, Jill watch posturing up. Has an open guard. Man, it's going to be a hot time in Old Town tonight for one of these guys, because this fight is going off. Oh, let's see. Mias Mio can do anything to get up. He's not taking a lot of damage, but again, being stuck on your back for most of the fights, not going to win any favors with the judges. Yeah, yeah. You know, a lot of heart. A lot of heart for both guys. They're both doing everything they can to win. Oh, here we go. Something's working. See if he can find Maybe his way to his kick. feet. Oh, look at this going old school. Oh, the referee's gonna give him a chance to stand up. Cambodian straight in on the aggression. That's an interesting choice from the tie. The Cambodian uh, back down to the ground. Committing so hard to those strikes, just giving the takedown there. On his back oh, again. Oh, he's got a nice guillotine in there, pretty the deep. Arm in, and at this point probably. in the fight, both guys gotta be pretty tired. The tap comes. Night. Cambodia coming in. Fight fans and party people. If you enjoyed that, enjoy more F -f -f full metal content and hit the subscribe button. Do it.